Good morning and a very happy new year to you. Hopefully we all had a good Christmas period and new year um, and kind of getting back to normality a little bit now. We've um, got, well the kids are here for one more day, they go back to school tomorrow uh, and uh, Sarah went back to work today. So um, as of tomorrow I can get back to uh, making some videos and um, that week I had off I think is, um, it's been quite good. It's, uh, I didn't have to think about it, it refreshed me and there's, um, there's several things I've now seen that I want to talk about. But for today, what I want to talk about is um, the uh, snow foam lance that I got what before Christmas. I'll show you a minute, Thomas. Um, and if you, I don't know if you saw the video, if you didn't, basically uh, I wanted to uh, give it a go, see if they were any good, because I've never ever used one before. So um, what I wanted to do is find out whether they were worth having. Um, for me, it's about uh, how fast can I clean my car and how good can the result be at the end of it. Yeah, you know, so it looks good, but um, there's so many other things to do in life I haven't got the time to spend on it anymore. So hopefully this will be a product that will speed that up and uh, give me better results than just using uh, a bucket and sponge. Uh, so I had a look around. Um, as I said, I didn't want one of the, the you know, you can spend a fortune, you can spend, literally spend hundreds of pounds on these things. Uh, I wasn't gonna do that in case it was rubbish. Uh, also, I looked at some of the cheaper ones, uh, and there was one in particular I looked at that matched my power watch washer, um, but the reviews on it were mixed at best, actually they were quite poor. So uh, I've settled on one um, from a company called Pro, uh, Pro Clean. Um, it's Pro, Pro Clean's Snow Foam Lance, and um, it came just before Christmas. Basically in the box you get um, the bits and pieces for the lance, and um, if you buy it on Amazon, I'm sure you can get it elsewhere, you also get the snow foam um, car cleaner that, that should go with it. Now, for the two, uh, at the moment on Amazon, I think it's 29.95 here in the UK. So in the box, you get uh, a bottle, which uh, will go on the bottom of the lance, and you get the lance itself, which feels quite sturdy, I have to say. It's um, made of metal, uh, you have to tell them the attachment that you want for your pressure washer because that will go straight into the, um, the front of it. Uh, and it looks like there's um, several adjustments so you can adjust the density of the foam coming out with the um, air intake and everything else to get the, you know, the, the foam that you want on your car, whether it be thick or thin, however, however you want it. So that feels like quite a sturdy product, I have to say. Um, and certainly when I picked up some of the cheaper ones, they didn't feel anywhere near as, um, as good quality as this. So um, that's what comes in it. There's a, a little tube in there that obviously attaches up. You pop it on there, attach it to your pressure washer, and away you go. Um, the product that you put in it, as I say, is this uh, snow foam. Uh, this one is cherry fragrance. Um, I've never thought I needed to smell, I have a clean, car cleaner that smelled good, but um, let's see what it smells like. You know, yeah, that, what does that smell of to you? Cherries. You think cherries? Oh, oh cherries, does, but, cherries with... Do you know what I think it smells of? What? Cherry Bakewell. Oh yeah, that's what I... That, that what you were like, thinking of? Yeah, I forgot its name. Cherry Bakewell. Um, and actually, worse than that, it smells of, um, I think, amaretto. What's amaretto? It's, uh, it's a grown up drink with alcohol in. Uh -huh. um, now, by the time I finish washing my car with that, I'm, I might need a drink. But, um, yeah, let's see what that's like. I, I have no idea. It's, um, it's the, made by the same company that make the Lance, so uh, hopefully it will work really well together. Right, we've got a break in the cloud, so um, let's give it a go. Right, that's the worst of the dirt off. Let's see how easy this is to actually set up. It looks like I've gone through about 300 mil, so um, you do get through it quite quickly. Well, I have to say, it lathers up pretty well, even after being on for five minutes, so that's pretty good. I have to say, 
I'm pretty impressed. Um, I don't know if you can see it particularly well. It needs a dry and probably a bit of a polish to um, decide whether it's done a, a really good job. But um, unfortunately, it's just started raining again. So um, I think if we go inside, uh, I'll talk to you a bit more about it there. Well, I have no idea where the day's gone. Uh, we've just got to the end of it. The kids are getting ready for bed. Uh, and I thought this would probably be a good time just to kind of uh, finish off what I was um, talking about before and my kind of my thoughts on this uh, snow foam lance. Um, in a nutshell, I really liked it. Um, and the reason I liked it is because I found that the, um, the way it cleaned the car, it made it a lot easier. Uh, and I think probably less chance of scratching the paintwork and um, damaging the car. And the reason for that seems to be that once you spray the foam on, it sits on the car and it breaks down the dirt. Now you do still need to use that sponge, but it comes off so much easier. And I think, especially in the summer, that's gonna come into its own when you think about the, um, you know, dried on flies that you end up getting all over the front of your car. Uh, I think the five minutes of allowing that foam to soak into it, it is going to really work. Um, certainly better than any other products I've used before. I can never seem to get them off. Um, I think uh, the as far as is it value for money for everyone, I think a lot of people will find it expensive and probably look at it as a, as a bit of a gimmick. Um, the the litre that I bought or that came with it um, of uh, car wash, the, the foam product you put into it. Uh, for a litre, it's between eight and nine pounds. Um, I think if you bought a five litre one, it's about 15 pounds. If you buy 10 litres, it's about 22, 23 pounds. So the more you buy, the cheaper it gets. Um, I, it, I think you can probably get five washes out of every litre, um, which is using slightly less than it recommends. But uh, once I started soaping it, there was more than enough soap on there to, to get around the car. It, did it easily um, and by doing it that way I think you will just eke it out that little bit more and you'll still get the same results. Um, it certainly get through it quickly but that the litre that I made up um, which is one part wash to three parts water that easily did my leaf no problem at all um, all right you can't hang about going over and going over it but I got around the car and still had a bit left to kind of redo the roof and a few of the windows so Definitely more than enough in a bottle there. I thought the quality of the product felt very good with the you know the weight of it. It's, it's made of um, metal, so um, it's definitely not going to break quickly and loads of control over it. Uh, so that was really, really good. Um, to kind of sum it up, I think if you're a person that is happy to spray the car with water and wash it with a sponge, uh, you're not going to necessarily uh, find any benefit or find a reason to part with your money with, with this. Uh, I personally liked it uh, I'm going to use it again uh, and I will buy some more um, product to put in it uh, I think it was worth 30 pounds um, and that was purely because once I went at the car with the sponge it made it so much easier to clean and so much quicker the overall time was probably about the same but I just found that I wasn't scrubbing around the car with a sponge for, for as long so um, for me it was good so with that um, in mind uh, I think I'll bring today's video to an end. Um, I'll put all the links down below so you can see what the product is. Um, I'll put the link for Amazon so you can sort of see the reviews and things for yourself um, and see why I went for it really. Uh, so yes, if you enjoyed today's video, remember to like and share it. And if you're not doing so already, subscribe to the channel and I'll see you again soon.